friends, our book of the day is ta -da, The Bat Who Wore Glasses. Once there was a little bat who could not see very well. He bumped into a lot of things while flying. His friends always laughed and made fun of him because he couldn't fly well. Well, that's not very nice. I don't like that. We don't laugh at our friends. The little bat wanted to fly and play like his friends, but he just sat and watched them play. This made the little bat so sad that he wanted to quit and never try to fly again. But his mother always told him, you should never give up. If you keep trying, things will work out. The little bat climbed a tree. He lifted his wings and felt the warm breeze on his body. As the wind lifted him off the ground, he knew that he would do it this time. But no matter how hard he tried, he couldn't see anything in front of him unless it was very, very close. Suddenly, he lost control and slammed into a light post. Wham! crashed into a telephone pole. Boom! And finally, he ran into a big fat tree. Smack! Poor little bat. He started falling and fast. While the bat was falling, a man was walking by. The little bat kept falling. He flipped and flopped and flopped and flipped and then... Kaboom! He finally crashed on top of the man's head and knocked the man's glasses off. Both the man and the bat fell to the ground. The man's glasses flew up in the air and landed right onto the little bat's face. Both the man and the bat were very dizzy. But when the little bat blinked his eyes, he was very surprised that he could see everything around him. The man got up after his fall, but without his glasses, he couldn't see very well. So luckily, he had an extra pair of glasses. He pulled them out of his pocket, put them on, and then started to walk home. The little bat could see could now see everything. He loved seeing the tops of trees, the blooming flowers, and all the other animals in the wild woods. Now that the bat could see, he knew that he could fly as well as his friends. He climbed up on the limb of a tree, slowly scooted out to the end, and then lifted his wings. He closed his eyes and jumped off of the branch. He started flying and at first he was scared until he remembered his mother's words. Your wings can carry you over your dreams. But then he surprised himself. He started flying high and low and everywhere. The next day, he went to tell his friends about his luck, but they laughed at him because of his glasses and because they didn't believe that he could fly. The little bat became very angry when his friends laughed at him. He wanted to prove them wrong. So he climbed to a very high rooftop, lifted his wings, and began to fly. These are not friends. They're not nice to him. Those are not friends. They're just other bat kids, but they're not his friends. This time, 
He flew the best that he had ever flown. He did loops and turns and dives right over his friends' heads. The little bat's friends were so surprised by how well he could fly that they all apologized to him and then challenged him to a race. Oh, that makes me so happy. They apologized for not being nice. Oh, the end. The bat who wore glasses. All right, friends. Talk to you later. Bye.